Let's flip to the PTO side. Now we're not on the cover side anymore. We're going to put the exhaust back on. If I'm looking in my box, I need my exhaust gasket and my two exhaust nuts. And you may have one other self-tapping flange bolt that's going to go right here. I don't. I'm not going to worry. All right, so exhaust gasket has to go on the correct way. The little pins have to go towards. These two little pins go towards the engine. And when I put it on, those pins should fit in. And I should be in the center. If you take a peek, flip it over. As long as the pins are going in, you're okay. You're going to grab your muffler. If you remember, this is the muffler. I'll back this off a little bit. Tighten up your, or get your muffler nuts started. 12 millimeters, start them with the screwdriver as always. If it doesn't start nice and smooth, something's cross-threaded, back it up. Put it back on. Going to take a quick peek. You can hear the pages of my manual going. Muffler nuts, M. Those are 17 foot-pounds. 17 foot-pounds is 204, so 194 on my torque wrench. Again, set it to 180 at the zero and then go to 14. Nice and easy, just pushing down. Got the click. Got the click. Double check. Double check. Double check, check your trip check in case you don't remember that one. And there is the muffler on. If you do happen to have that last flange right there, set that to 58 foot-pounds and put that in.